When you're checking out coins on sites like CoinGecko, Gecko Terminal, or even Token Terminal, you're bound to come across two numbers called Fully Diluted Valuation (FDV) and Market Capitalization (Market Cap). And while both of these numbers can tell you how much coins like Lido are actually worth, violent word wars have been fought as to which is actually more valuable. So today, we're going to sort out the Great Valuation Dilemma. But first, why is it important to know the valuation of coins? To answer this, you must remember the very basics of how to make money from investing. Buy low, sell high. The FDV and market cap numbers let you gauge whether a coin is undervalued or overvalued and whether it's worth your time and money. For example, if a bleep coin is trading at a $10 billion valuation, you might want to think twice before going in with granny's retirement funds. But just because something is expensive doesn't mean that it's overvalued. If Project X has a $1 billion valuation, but you know for sure that its technology will one day revolutionize the entire galaxy, then it might still be a good idea to invest in since it has the potential for $5 billion, $10 billion, or more. FDV and market cap let you make better and more informed investment decisions. But what are they? Fully diluted valuation, or FDV, is the total valuation of the project once all of the coins that will ever exist are in circulation. When you see headlines like this on the news, the valuation portion always refers to the project's FDV. If you knew the total supply of coins of Scroll, then you'd be able to easily work out the price that these investors bought at too. Market cap, on the other hand, refers to the total valuation of the coins in circulation. Coins that are not in circulation, such as those that are locked or vesting, will only be counted once they are released. Big cap coins like Ethereum or Bitcoin are often treated as a more stable investment compared to small cap coins, which may give you a higher return on investment but are typically more volatile. In general, market cap is the more popular metric and widely used to rank the popularity and size of coins. And while FDV is generally regarded as the lesser known sibling that no one really wants to play with, in the right hands it can be a powerful tool. FDV may be a good metric for long-term investors to judge whether a project's valuation is reasonable. And used together with market cap, it can let you take into account the impact of future supply changes. In short, it's hard to say which of the two is more useful, but one thing's for sure. Market cap and FDV serve different functions. And the best move is for you to analyze both to get the most holistic picture of a project's worth.